what we want to do for this problem is we have x plus x squared y, or x squared times y plus x cubed y squared. So what we want to do for this problem is, remember, we want to write our factor. When we're factoring, we want to write it as a product of our factors, right? We want to write it as a multiplication product. So right now I have three numbers all added up together, or three terms all added up together. So what I'm going to want to do is see, can I rewrite this as a multiplication problem? Well, to rewrite as a multiplication problem, I want to see, can I divide out the same number? Can I divide out a number that all three of these share? So we take a look at it and say we have x, x squared y, plus x cubed y squared. So we don't have any numbers, but do they share something else in terms of variables? Do they share something else? X, right? So therefore, here's 1x, here's x times x, and here's x times x times x. So yeah, I can't factor out the x's. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to say, all right, I want to factor out the x. So when you factor out the x, what we're doing is I'm going to divide it out and see what my other answer is. So one factor is an x. x evenly divides into all three of those, correct? Does everybody understand that? Everybody would agree to me that they all share an x. So x evenly divides into all three of those. That's one factor. Okay? What is the other resulting factor? Well, what happens when you divide each one of these terms by x? x divided by x is 1. x squared, when I divide an x squared by x, rules of exponents, right? x squared divided by x equals x. Can I divide y by x? Are those like terms? Nope. So it's just going to leave that y there. Plus x cubed, the rules of exponents. Plus x squared, y squared. So therefore, my other factor is x, and then the other factor is 1 plus x times y plus x squared, y squared. Okay? So what that means, all I did was I broke it down into a multiplication of two factors. That's all the factoring is. I don't understand what you did the first time when you go up to the side. I was just doing the math. I was dividing x squared divided by x, which is x. Then I did x cubed divided by x, which is x squared. Do you remember that? The rules of exponents? I remember the rules. Yeah, so in the rules, remember there's a 1 there. Right? Just remember, it's just all about the rules of exponents. You gotta remember when you divide exponents, you're in. And I couldn't do anything with the y because you can't factor a, a, a x out of the y's. So the y's are gonna 